my friend here. We are going to do a fraction math lesson, and I want you, you, you to join me and learn how to do your fractions. Boys and girls, a fraction is made up of two numbers, a top number and a bottom number. The top number tells how many parts we are talking about. The bottom number tells how many parts are in the whole group. The question is, what fraction of the piglets are black? First, how many piglets are there, boys and girls? Two. And how many piglets are black? One. So the fraction is one half of the piglets are black. Remember, the bottom number two represents how many in the whole group of pigs, and the top number one represents how many piglets are black. One half. Great job. <laughs> Boys and girls, here's a mother pig with her babies called piglets. Are you ready to do some fractions with mom and her babies? What fraction of the piglets are black, boys and girls? First, how many piglets do you see? Yes, four. How many piglets are black? Two. The fraction is two-fourths. The bottom number four tells us how many piglets in all. The number two tells us two of the piglets are black. Two-fourths is our fraction. Or we can say one half. Half of the piglets are black and half of the piglets are white. What fraction of the llamas are brown? First, boys and girls, how many llamas do you see? Three. And how many of the llamas are brown? Two. So the fraction for the brown llamas is two-thirds. There are three llamas and two of them are brown, two-thirds. Here are our cute little piglets again, boys and girls. What fraction of the piglets are white? Remember, first count how many piglets you see in all. How many piglets do you see? Yes, five. How many piglets are white? Yes, three. So what is the fraction, boys and girls? Three fifths. The bottom number five tells us how many piglets in all, and the top number three tells us how many little piglets are white. Our fraction is again, Yell it out! Three fifths. Here at the farm, boys and girls, you see three baby goats. Now, what fraction of the goats are standing? Remember to count all of the goats. How many are there? Three. How many of those goats are standing? One. So what is the fraction for the goats that are standing? One third. Good job, boys and girls. Boys and girls, did you know a baby goat is called a kid? Well, we're going to look at these kids here. What fraction of the kids are standing? Did you say two thirds? Correct! There are three kids and two of them are standing. So the fraction is two thirds. Yell it out, boys and girls. Two thirds. Boys and girls, let's do a fraction with the mother goat in it. What fraction of the goats is a mother? Did you say one fourth? There are four goats and one is a mother. So one-fourth of the goats is the fraction we were looking for. Here we are again at the farm with Mother Pig and her babies. What fraction of the piglets are brown? Boys and girls, think about what I told you to do first. That is how you start to figure out the fraction. What fraction of the piglets are brown? One-sixth. Good job. 
What fraction of the piglets are black? Two six. Good job again. What fraction of the piglets are white? Did you say three six? Or one half of the piglets are white? Because both fractions are correct. Boys and girls, give yourself a pat on the back. Great job! I hope you enjoyed learning from me because I enjoyed teaching you. See you the next time. Bye.